Here's my new machine. It's just a little bit more complicated than the first one. Instead of one cotton reel, I now have two cotton reels, and I have a bigger wheel that touches the two cotton reels at their center parts and turns against them. So it's easy to see what happens when the cart moves to the right, the little wheels turn clockwise, and the big wheel turns anti-clockwise against the little wheels. Now here's the question. I've got a ruler. I'm going to move this ruler to the right above the cart. If I touch the big wheel with the ruler, which way is the cart going to move? George here thinks it's obvious. He says, the ruler moves to the right. That's going to make the big wheel turn clockwise. That's going to make the little wheels turn anti-clockwise. The cart's going to move to the left. Coco thinks it can't work at all because the ruler is going to pull the big wheel to the right, but that makes the little wheels turn anti-clockwise. That's going to pull the cart to the left, so it's being pulled to the right and the left. It won't move at all. And Louise here, she thinks it's going to move to the right, but she's not quite sure why. Terry, of course, knows exactly what's going to happen, but he's not going to tell. So we'll just have to try it out. I get my ruler, place it above the cart, and now I'm going to move the ruler to the right. And look what happens. The cart really does move to the right. Now I'm going to move it back to the left. Moving the ruler to the left makes the cart move to the left. And the interesting thing is that the cart is going faster than the ruler. Let's have a look again. I put the ruler on the cart and I start moving the ruler and you can see the cart's going about twice the speed of the ruler. Another interesting thing is to look at the way the big wheel is turning. You might think, like George thought, if the ruler is moving to the right that's got to make this big wheel turn clockwise. But let's have a look. It makes the big wheel turn anti-clockwise against the direction of the ruler. So, there we have the machine that moves under the ruler faster than the ruler.